One of WA's biggest gas projects desperately needs more workers as it accelerates homegrown construction. But as Nick Way reports, there are concerns local companies are still missing out on the boom. Looking like spaceships, they're set to launch careers. The Gorgon Joint Venture Roadshow pushing to sign on 650 new workers within six weeks, adding to the 1,000 already building the giant gas production trains. Boilermakers, welders, fitters, um, trades assistants, operators. But the target staff levels two and a half thousand in Perth and on Barrow Island. Studies show Gorgon's up local content from 44 to 64 percent in the past year. Uh, to make sure that we do get a, a greater slice of the engineering pie. We're not getting the major engineering, design, fabrication and manufacturing jobs. The opposition says local fabricators missed out on the big ticket items when contracts were awarded in previous years. 400,000 tonnes of steel, that is the bulk of the project, all went overseas. 85 uh, companies which are relocating operations from offshore to here in Perth and in Western Australia. Overall, $30 billion worth of local Gorgon works so far yielded an estimated 75,000 jobs. We are going to be doing uh, tours around uh, Perth, regional West Australia. And the tempting bottom line, work as a boilermaker here and you'll gross around 120000 a year. But head north to Barrow where these components are going and that jumps to more than 160000 I'll say, yeah, jump aboard is all good and other wages are good. Yeah, so, yeah, it's jump on board, yeah. The roadshow starts in Bunbury next week. Nick Way, 10 News.